Hello everyone, hope you guys are doing fine today. A couple of days ago when we were having our live stream, someone asked me about this flight QR920 Doha to Auckland from Qatar Airways. So let's talk about this flight today. This afternoon is Thursday, November 24th, about 1 p.m. This is the flight route according to Google Maps. When you type the cities of Doha and Auckland, this is what they give us. And this is the flight route according to the Great Circle Map website, which officially gives us the shortest route on a globe. So according to this route, the flight should fly over Australia, coming from the northwest of Australia, crossing and reaching Auckland, New Zealand, according to the shortest route on a globe calculated by this website called the Great Circle Map. But when we look at the flight route according to flight radar, we see that things are not actually like that. So FlightAware has the flight route live, the playback live. So as you see there, right there you see that it goes way south of India and then heads towards the south of Australia. No way is coming from the northwest of Australia or even north of Australia. As we saw, it goes under Australia, south of Australia, south of Tasmania, and then going northeast towards Auckland. Pretty weird flight path on the globe. And you see it doesn't match any of these two on the globe. If it was a ball, it should definitely match with that. But let's now compare on a flat earth map and see what we get. So here we have the mouse. We are going around Australia along the jet streams. So this flight leaves Doha, goes straight south of India towards the jet stream, then flies along the jet stream south of Australia and Tasmania and then reaches Auckland. So this is exactly the path of this flight. It makes more sense on the flat earth map. Let's compare one more time here. And see it on the flat earth map in yellow is the my flight route. I should have done it the way exactly like shows there south of Tasmania. Uh, but it, it, that's how it is. It, uh, it just flies along the jet stream. As you observe here, flying south of India towards uh, the south of Australia. And once it gets on the jet stream, it flies along the jet stream all the way until it arrives in Auckland. It makes sense on the flat earth map, it makes zero sense on the ball earth. You see there all those flights flying along the Antarctic Circle fly along the jet streams. We do not live on a ball, flight routes prove that the earth is flat, flight routes prove that the earth is not spinning, and flight routes proof that we live on a stationary flat earth. Thanks guys, I hope to see you again next week. I'm having live streams now, Sunday nights USA time, around 8 p.m. New York City time, 7 p.m. Alabama time, and uh, we will we'll be talking about more flights. So thanks for watching this short video, take care, see you next time, bye bye. Turn and 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 turn and